it's one of my favorite quick tips. I had no idea that this existed. If you go into the Finder and go to the View menu, Show Preview, or if you've got, if you've got it up already, then you know that you can do this. Hide Preview. Paul was was actually having a tr having a problem with previews sticking, and uh, I had no idea. Maybe we've talked about it on the show before, but I it, it's not part of my my cognitive lexicon to know that there are previews available in finder and it it's actually a pretty cool little uh little thing if you if you know what it is but yeah i've yeah. i've had it enabled for years it never occurred to me that it that you could do it any other <laughs> way. yeah and, and i i love it it's just, it's so oh that's exactly what i'm looking for Sounds yeah like that. it's faster yeah you, you get the a really sort of contextualized get info window yeah uh right there yeah it, it's great if uh though yeah, it tells you the size of the file. Oh, it does down at the bottom. Like for instance, in a photo, it gives you the resolution. That's yeah. one of the really nice things. Say, hey, which one am I looking at? Is that the small version or the? Yeah, version? Yeah. yeah, yeah. Like I have an audio file here, and it shows me the duration and sample rate, in addition to sort of the you, yeah. you know the the created, modified, last open. All the metadata. All the metadata. Yeah, yeah. It's a cool thing. So, thank you for unintentionally contributing that quick tip, Paul, and hopefully the issue that. Came up with. Um, well, he was trying to hide soft. it, right? He, he was, was trying to hide it. it. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. But he again, he didn't. He like he was like, I have no idea how I turn this on. How do I turn it off? It's like, yeah, here you go.